Hi guys, welcome to another vlog. Today I'm going to show you how to cut carbon fibre on a 60-40 Chinese CNC machine. My 3D printer is going to be running, so I apologise if you can hear it in the background. With my carbon fibre, I like to use these uh, circuit board, the PCB cutters. This one's 1 8 inch. Uh, I just find these do a really good job and leave a really nice edge on the carbon cut. I'll just run through and show you the settings I have for the cutter. 1 8 inch cutter. It's 2 mil thick carbon that we're using today, um, cutting full depth. Uh, don't really need to worry about the step over in this case, um, but I just have 40% generated on that one. Spindle speed I control at the machine. I don't know the RPM off the top of my head, but I'll, I'll pop it on the screen here. Feed rate of 600 millimeters per minute and the plunge at 150. Seem to work really good at getting a good surface finish and keeping the dust located in the join, which I'll show you shortly. setting the Z height with a piece of paper. Uh, I do have a touch off tool in this situation. I don't think it's worth the time. I like to just double check that my part fits in uh, within the, the borders of the sheet. You can see the tool still has a little bit to go before it gets to the end there. I have my carbon fiber on a vacuum table that I've made which is powered by a little Azito vacuum cleaner. This is the double-sided tape and super glue method to stick it down. I will also run the vacuum cleaner while it's cutting. Definitely don't want to breathe that in. Now, ordinarily I would cut uh, with the dust shield on, but I just wanted to film for you guys. After the cut, 
there may be some fine sort of fibers that are still sticking out from the resin. I don't know how good you get to see that there. But it's used some 600 wet and dry, a soft sanding block, and some soapy water. Lightly knock those edges off. And that's it. Super easy to do. I recommend it if you're into robotics or drones or anything like that. Really great if you've got a little CNC router. Uh, make some really cool stuff that way. And that's going to do it for this one. Thank you guys so much for spending this time with me. And I'm going to see you in the next one.